All right, guys, here it is, the RF-1400 by Shoei. I've owned this helmet for about a year now, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick and to-the-point review and also compare and contrast it against the RF-1200, which, which I also own for about a year. Right off the bat, the biggest difference between the 1200 and the 1400 is the way that it fits around your face. There's quite a bit more padding around the cheeks, on the 1400 compared to the 1200 on the 1200 i wore a size xl and it fit pretty snug but on the 1400 i had to wear a size l it seemed like around in the back in the top on the um in the in the 1400 up there it felt a little bit loose while on the 1200 it felt snug and the exact opposite around the cheeks. On the 1400, I noticed it, it was uh, it was really tight around my, my cheeks that has worn in a little bit. But I did not like how much it was pressing my cheeks in in the beginning. But like I said, it has gotten a little bit better. Noise dampening. The 1400 is definitely a little bit quieter. It's not a huge difference, but there is... A bit more noise on the 1200 the 1400 is also slightly heavier so if you're a weight snob you might be able to no notice a difference I wasn't able to but according to the spec sheet it is slightly heavier and the vent system is different it's very easy to actuate the front vents and it no longer has that dreaded rear vent that you could never tell if it was open or closed on the 1200. On the 1400, it is always open. And last but not least is the center lock. It now has a tab in the center rather than on the side. A lot of people don't like that, but it doesn't really make a big difference to me. And also, it now locks in all the way. It clicks in. Hear that? So there is a positive lock, and to unlock it, you do have to push this in right here. So now, what's the final verdict? Which one do I like more? Definitely the 1200. The 1200 is just definitely more comfortable around the cheek area. However, this is still a very comfortable helmet. It is expensive though. I bought it for around $600. I think it is about $50 cheaper now at $550. But if you can find a 1200 used, definitely get that. All right, guys, I hope that helps you.